Hello and welcome to Transmitting Until Robots Replace Us. My name is Drew, call sign AC3DS. I'm really glad that you're here. Today we're going to talk about how to use the clock, set the clock, see the clock on the ICOM 7300. So let's start by putting two minutes on the clock. If you're making contacts and logging those contacts, then you're going to land up needing the time that those contacts were occurring, right? When those communications happened. And there is a clock built into the 7300 and it's being displayed here in the top right corner. So it's based off of a 24 hour time. And if I hold that down, I can actually see both the current clock time uh, for me, it's Eastern Standard Time. And then here's my UTC time. So showing me the difference. Because again, some of the logbooks are going to want to use that UTC time. Um, so it's nice and easy to be able just to quickly access and see it. Like, oh wait, what is it again, UTC? Oh wait, it's, oh well, it's that time UTC. And so really nice, very convenient. So how do you set it? Well, you can set this by going into the menu, go to Set, then you're going to go to time set. You've got your date time. So you could set the date to whatever particular day it is. And then your time to uh, the time as it is for you, uh, based off of a 24 hour time. And as opposed to something else, I'm not sure, I guess 12 hour. Um, and then you have your UTC offset. So for me, it's minus five. And that just helps to calibrate everything and makes, makes it clean and simple to be able to click on it and quickly get the time. There you have it. That's how you use the clock and set the clock on the 7300.